My middle name is Lola, and I really identify with that name. Most of the people in my life tell me it really fits my personality, and I'd really agree with that. I just love the name Lola because to me it sounds so free and fun and now that I think about it a lot of the things I just really gravitate toward in my life are the things that feel like freedom. My childhood room was covered head to toe in posters of everything in the widest range possible from Taylor Swift to the Beatles to old Audrey Hepburn films and you know there was really no limit or bound to how much I could try to do and how many passions or interests I could tackle. I was four when I realized you could write about your feelings and I just never stopped. I write every single night in my journal about the day I had or something I felt that day because I really love to immortalize memories. From then on, whenever anybody asked me what I want to be and what I want to do when I grow up, I always said I wanted to be a writer. It was just really clear for me. Music has been a really important part of my upbringing and I've always just naturally gravitated toward love songs. I keep all of these CDs in my car and I put them in and you know roll the windows down and play these songs that I've kind of grown up always loving. My first memory of love is my dad squeezing my hand three times as a kid and telling me that means I love you. When I think of the feeling of love for me it feels just like freedom. Strange because throughout my whole childhood I always just wanted to grow up as fast as I could and now here I am getting ready to go off to college and it's crazy knowing that I'm about to leave it all behind. Even though I know I'm not a kid anymore and I don't search for, you know, fairies and flowers, I still have a really vivid imagination and that's something I never want to let go of.